This is a brand new type of brush from Da Vinci, and this is called Colineo brushes. It's meant to imitate the fibers of a Kolinsky brush, and it comes very, very close. Kolinsky brushes, very expensive. We're gonna paint some ruffles today. So to make something like this a lot easier on yourself, you can start by just kind of outlining where those ruffles end. With these types of pleats, there's always going to be a pretty sharp drop shadow right below where that pleat lands. So usually I don't approach paintings by like outlining things, right? It's not exactly tattooing. But when it comes to subject matter that is a little bit more complicated, it's a little bit more compact and you really have to kind of use a lot of thinking power, I basically just try to simplify it as much as I can. From there, I'm gonna go in with that secondary purple. Just making marks right now. I'm not necessarily trying to make a finished product at this point and I'm just kind of building it up as I go. Make sure you have yourself a mall stick because you don't want arthritis. That's never fun. So because I'm going in with that secondary color right after that drop shadow, I'm able to kind of blend as I go. From there, I'm gonna go ahead and go in just like with a little bit of the highlight that I see there, which is more of a, it's like a blue almost. And just kind of placing it down see it and I'm actually not even using any mixing medium at this point if I do use a mixing medium it doesn't have any dryers in it 